Hello, Gamer Nom is back. And in this video, we're going to help this noob with the Dove Fruit reach max level. But before we start, you can show your support by using Starcode Gamer Nom when purchasing your Robux. 5% of the earnings will go to this channel, and this will really help us make better videos. Oh, and one more thing, make sure to follow my Twitter account if you want to know more about my boring life. Where the actors slam on their dancing forward, there's your slam! So before I start this video, shout out to Rip Indra, please give me a level 1 noob with CDK so I can grind with it. Anyways, let's focus on the grinding. First up, kill 5 bandits. Okay, so let's showcase the Z skill, the fried dough. There you go. Damage is good, multi-target. There you go. Usually players reach level 10, right, in this island. Oh, by the way, this fruit is elemental, which means if you reach a certain level, you are immune to enemies. There you go, at level 10, we can now head to the jungle, okay? Because there is a new quest. That quest is the monkey quest, but guys, it sucks. I suggest go back to the starter island and reach level 15. What is your reason, Gamer Nom? They are so far apart. Anyways, when you reach level 15, now is the time to do the gorilla quest. So you need to defeat 8. Tip, use high ground at first because again, they don't have hockey. And once you unlock your elemental effect, for those asking, you will unlock it at level 20. So once you reach level 20, you can now decide whether to continue defeating the Gorillas or start defeating the Gorilla King. Okay, so if you want to defeat the Gorilla King, tip, use the high ground, minimal damage, or if you know how to create distance properly, you won't get damage. So guys, target level here is 35. The next island is the Pirate Village. So why 35 Gamer Nom? Because the pirates, elemental effect is at level 35, which means they won't be able to damage you again. Only sad thing about this fruit is the mastery requirement for every skill for you to unlock. Anyways guys, at level 45, you can start defeating the brutes. So same strategy guys, there will be no damage inflicted because again, you are using an elemental fruit. So target here is level 55, next up is Bobby the Clown. So you're gonna grind here until level 60. Yes, you can start doing server hop here. There you go. So guys, next island is the desert. So guys, in the desert, first target is the desert bandits. Elemental is in effect at an early level. So guys, just keep on defeating them until you reach level 75. Once you reach level 75, next stop, the desert officers. There you go. Strategy gamer now, actually, there are no strategies here, just keep on defeating them. You will unlock your F skill, the roller donut here. There you go. Again, you're gonna leave this area at level 90. Okay, after that, next island is the Frozen Village. Guys, don't forget to visit the ability teacher located at the cave. So for everything he sells, you need at least 135,000 bellies. Next up, head to the Snow Bandits. You're gonna grind here until level 90. Don't worry guys, at this level, elemental sin effect again. So at level 105, target is the Yeti. So guys, you're gonna server hop here until you reach level 120. Avoid grinding the snowman because they're so far apart. Stat check. Here you go guys. Nearly 35, defense 45, block plus 280. Next island is the Marine Fortress. Don't forget to buy the Black Cape for 50,000 bellies. This increases your damage. Also, plus HP and energy. Next target is the Chief Petty Officers, level 120. Again, elemental is in effect. There you go, very easy grinding. Level 130, you can start defeating the Vice Admiral. We're going to do server hop here, guys. This boss is the best place to earn money in the first sea. But if you decide to grind here, you will get low mastery. Anyways, you will unlock a new skill. The Axis skill, Sticky Dough. Here it is. There you go. Finally, we have three skills. Okay, so again, grind here until 220. Next island is the prison. So in the prison, we have three bosses. Warden at 220, Chief Warden at 230, Swan at 240. All of them, guys, you can use wall strat. How do you do it? Just look for a wall and that's it. Use your skills until you defeat them. Okay, so same strategy with the Chief Warden. There you go. Easy kill and Swan. Guys, but for Swan, just a reminder, you might get damaged. There you go, see that guys? But you can tank the damage, no worry, okay? So we're gonna grind here until 350. Guys, please report this cheater, check that out. I died. <laughs> there you go, report this one. Anyways, target level 350. 
And after that, next island is the Magma Village. So our target here is Magma Admiral, server up until 425. So guys, just dodge this skill. Use your own, your own skills. There you go. And that's it. Very easy guys, repetitive. Anyways, check this out. A light foot user attacked us. So let's defeat this Magma Admiral first. And then light versus no fruit. Let's go. Katakori versus uh, Kizaru, right? So I think we're gonna defeat this one. Oops. Wait, we're gonna time it. Sticky though. Okay, he's too far away. Let's wait for him to dash. Use our fried dough. There you go. Boom. <laughs> oh, just got lucky. Anyway, guys, moving on. Next up, 425 Whirlpool. Target here is the Fishman Lord. Guys, Wall Strap, Gold Ears, level 500. Guys, this is one of the easiest boss to defeat in the first CY. Because again, there's a wall and the quest giver is really near. Check this out, guys. What are you doing? He's trying to steal our boss. Oops. Sorry, sorry. I apologize. Even though he's trying to steal our boss kill. <laughs> Anyways, I'm sorry, bro. So continue grinding again at the level 500. After that is the Skylands. So guys, in the Skyland, we're gonna go directly to the upper sky and start defeating the Whisper. So guys, you're gonna do this until level 637. You're gonna use the Stone Strap. Let's just stay here in the stone. Check it out, guys. The explosion of the bazooka cannot damage us. So guys, just create distance, use your skills, and that's it. We're gonna unlock our C skill, the Car of Doe, and I'm gonna show it to you. There you go. Now, four skills unlock, one more to go. There it is. Again, guys, target here is 637. Next up, the final island, the first C, the Fountain City. So guys, you don't need to worry. Target here is the Gali Pirate. Elemental is already in effect. So guys, there you go. Just keep on grinding here. See that, guys? No damage. Again, we're gonna grind here at the level 793, okay? So after that, defeat Ice Admiral, finish the prison quest, and we're gonna head to the second sea. By the way, guys, we can now awaken our, all our skills, but before we do that, let's unlock all the skills first, okay? So guys, let's head to the Swan Pirates until 925. Don't worry, guys, Elemental is already in effect, so we're just gonna keep on defeating them. Again, we skip lots of mobs here. And finally, we are going to unlock the V skill, the Restless Do Barrage. There you go, guys. Congratulations to this noob account. We've unlocked all the skills. So again, we're gonna grind here until level 925, right? Go. And once we reach this level, we're now heading to the green zone. But before that, let us awaken all our skills first. So guys, as a player who already defeated the Do King in the third C and finished the Doe quest. So there you go. I was carried here. Okay, good job. Thank you guys. Also, you need at least 18,500 fragments. Correct me if I'm wrong to awaken all the skills. So guys, this is the awakened F skill. There you go. M1 left click. Yes, you will have an M1 left click once awakened. This is the V skill. Check that out, guys. This one's really good. A game changer. C skill. This one looks like it has the Conqueror's Haki. Wow, really good, guys. And the Axis skill. We have two Axis skills. The one when you're in the air and the one in land. Okay? So this is the Z skill. Not much has changed. So, guys, there you go. What is our target level here, Game Winom? We're gonna grind here until reach level 1028. Okay, so once we reach that level, we are now heading to the next island. And that island is the Snow Mountains. Here, we're just gonna defeat one mob. Yes, we're gonna skip the other mob. And that mob is the Snow Troopers. Elemental effect at 1029. And we are going to keep leveling up here until we reach level 1150. Go once we reach that level. 1150, next stop is the Hot and Cold. We're only going to defeat one mob here, the Smoke Admiral. Also guys, we're gonna do server hop until 1288. We were able to defeat him in less than 30 seconds. Check that out. Someone is also trying to kill him. <laughs> Guys, we defeated him. Our saber was upgraded. Anyways, there you go. See that, guys? Anyways, let's follow our plan. We're gonna do server up here until level 1288. Next area is the cursed ship. There you go. Anyway, only one mob here again. The ship deck hand. Elemental effect is at level 1288. Guys, we're gonna grind here until 1394. 
Guys, you can also do wall strat here if you don't have a fruit that has elemental effect. Again, 1,394. Next up, the Ice Castle. Only target is the Arctic Warriors. We're gonna skip the Ice Admiral. Why? Because that's a lot easier. Again, we are choosing the easier path, and the fastest way to grind. Okay? Okay, so guys, our target level here is level 1473. Again, just a reminder. And after that, we are heading to Forgotten Island. So here, our only target is the Sea Soldiers. Target level 1552. Again, these mobs are really strong, but guys, they don't have uh, aura. So you can take advantage of the elemental effect. There you go. We're gonna skip the other mobs and focus on this mob, okay? So again, at 1552, make sure to finish all the quests with Indra, etc. And after that, actually just uh, half HP damage. There you go. I think that's not enough. One more Z skill. Boom. Okay. After that, head to the green zone, talk to Mr. Captain, and let's go to the third C, guys. Woo! We've reached third C. Congratulations to us. Now we're heading towards our first target is the Pirate Millionaires. Guys, elemental is in effect. Don't worry. Target level 1675. Guys, I'll be honest. If you're not using Buddha or elemental fruit here, it's really hard to grind in this early stage of the third C. Anyways, at this level, 1675. Next island is the Hydra Island. Target here is the Island Empress. Guys, uh, tip, all strat, you can do it, but I decided to use or defeat this boss face to face. Why? Because we have lots of cool skills. Anyways, target here is level 1750. And after that, we can now head to the Great Tree. Target here, Kilo Admiral, until 1869. Guys, check this out. We defeated Kilo Admiral, but someone's already attacking it. You know what will happen. He has Soul Guitar, CDK, <laughs> V4 Shark, Race, also God Human. <laughs> so, guys, I tried to fight him, but it's really hard, right? So, should you run? I guess we can run using the F skill, but no, we're gonna fight to the death. We're just waiting for our V skill to go down. There you go. But again, this is a losing battle. He has all the weapons to defeat us. There you go. Also, he has portal foot. <laughs> Anyways, continue grinding here until you reach level 1869. Next island is the Floating Turtle. Here, we're gonna defeat only one mob. And that mob is the Fishman Captain. Slow worry, log is in effect. Target here, 2055. So there you go, guys. Again, no need to teach you any tip here because they cannot damage us. Okay, so at 2055, next stop is the Hunted Castle. Again, here only one mob, and that mob is the Reborn Skeletons. Target here is 2161. Don't worry, again, you cannot be damaged by these mobs. There you go. So after this, final islands, the Sea of Treats. Peanut Scouts, guys, don't worry, they don't have aura. So target level 2214. Guys, actually, you can grind here until max level. If you're gonna ask me this is the fastest way, but I'm gonna show you the hard, kinda harder way, okay? Next up, Cake Land. Defeat Ice Cream Chefs until 2300. Don't worry, they don't have, again, uh, Haki or Aura. So you cannot be damaged. At 2300, I suggest go to the uh, Cookie Crafters, but head to the Chocolate Land. Guys, only grind here if you need to grind Conjured Cocos, because you can get damage here. Unless you're using Buddha. Anyways, Converted Coco is used to make a candy chalice for Doking. Okay? So guys, reach 2400 here. And I'm going to show you the final island. Here it is. So guys, no need to grind here. To be honest, you're going to reach max level here. I mean, we're going to reach max level here. So again, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters. I really appreciate you all. This is Gamer Nom. And Gamer Nom out.